down, pause right there, then I'm still going to hit parallel, and now come up. Alright, and you're going to use wow. yeah. What's up guys, I hope you enjoyed the first video of the squat series. We're gonna wrap it up in this video and it does stop abruptly, but that's just because we moved on to uh, other exercises, which I'll show you in another video, but I just don't wanna make it too long. Uh, so without further ado, here's so, the video. I'm squatting, is there a certain place I should keep my eyes and look, my head? Uh, what I like to do, what I like to think of is just like neutral, okay? So you don't wanna, some people want to squat in, do this, you do look up, all right? This bar is probably gonna roll on you, yeah. and it's gonna land on you. I'm just looking straight, okay? And then as I descend, I'm still looking straight. My head's not going down, my head's not going down. If I'm just scared the whole time, down, up. Just like dog yourself, pretty yeah. much. <laughs> So, when you got the belt on, when you're using a belt, you always want to think of breathing into it. If you rewind it, and you watch, I'll probably get like a blowfish in my stomach. So what you want to do is, like right now it's unlocked. We'll gain a little bit of weight during the holiday season. But uh, what you want to do is breathe into it, okay? So I'm doing this, and then think of Inhaling through a straw, okay? But instead of blowing here, because I used to think like, I puff up my chest, that's how, you, that's how you start leaning forward. So I'm here. Now I've got a big belly. Now I can squat. That will also help you to prevent from buckling or getting loose while you're under there. And get some water now. So we're gonna go with uh, like four to six reps. Um, the way I like to train, especially like for compound movements, lighter movements, you could go a little bit higher. But for big movements, always think of leaving like about two good reps left in the tank. Okay, so like if I finish and I'm like, oh, I could have got like five more, like I need to up the weight or yeah. do more reps. Yeah. And that's how that's how I like to train. That's how I like to train my clients as well. Um, but I always think like two good reps left in the tank. So if you hit six right now and you're like, nah, I felt like I could do a lot more, then we're gonna move some weight up. Okay. All right? Or we're gonna just have you do more reps. Okay. So. Okay. Yeah, man. So let's get it. Good. Yeah. Let's get it. Come on. Big breath. There we go. Easy work. Easy. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Uh, come on. Easy. Good. Yeah, man. Thank you. How'd that feel? Felt a lot better. My yeah. back isn't hurting. Good. Everything feels loose. Good, good, good. You didn't look as confident walking in there as, as you did walking out. Yeah. So good shit, man. <laughs> Thank you, Jeff. <laughs> All right. So, so Jeff threw us for a loop because um, on the last set we didn't get we didn't get it recorded, but I asked him to slow down. So we slowed down. He recruited a lot more muscles. Yeah, so we're good. dropping it to 185. We're gonna do like three or four sets of about like four reps yep. and just pause at the bottom. All right. Lately, 
it's just a slow descent and then just a pause at the bottom. So there's two, two types of pauses you might see. So sometimes you'll see like a pause like this and you're hanging out back here and then you come up. Okay? So that's going to get you going. Um, but to so put more, what I want you to do is come down. You might not hit all the way, but come down and pause. You might not be like full of right? 